So if you've just joined us, guys, it is all about the 1970s. And you know that your grandparents would have known that era really, really well. So if you're chilling with your grandma, your grandpa, make sure you whip out your phone, take a selfie, holler at us on Facebook or on Twitter. Now, something that was really big in the 1970s had to be the hair. Everyone had big hair, it was about the curls, it was about the perms. So today, we're actually going to be transforming our models today. We've got Sebastian and Jody giving them a little bit of a 70s-inspired look. Our hairstylist for today, Jenny, as well as Marianne, well Welcome to the show. Thank Jenny, you. what was the defining thing about hair in the 1970s? Well, uh, very big curls, backward fl uh, flicked backwards, mm -hmm. um, as big as you could get it. Um, there were also a lot of hippie styles where it was more just tousled down with plaits on the side. Mm -hmm. um, guys wore their hair a lot longer than they do today. We don't really have to do too much here today because it's actually... This is what I think you're going to get. Yeah. <laughs> a longer hairdo. More or less. Um, what about accessories? Because as you can see, I'm wearing a little bit of a headband, the flower crowns. Were they starting to come through at that time? Th definitely so. Um, think Woodstock, think hippies, think feathers in the hair, mm -hmm. plaits. Um, braids. It was quite a big braids. thing as well, the cornrows. And um, that's coming back now. Yes, that's really cool. And I think what I loved about the 70s hairstyle is that it was always attached to some kind of social empowerment or social struggle. And I think that's why the hippies started with all the, you know, like the braids and things. And of course, the afro, the sign of black empowerment. What are you going to be doing with, with, with our models today? Well, um, with Sebastian here, I'm not going to do too much styling. I'm just going to show how they wore it, more or less as it is, a little bit of a grown out style. Okay. And with Jody, we're going to make big curls, backward flicks. You can see her hair is quite, um, quite styled straight at the moment. We, yeah. By the end of it, she's going to look completely different. Now, do you have any tips for our viewers? If they ever want to incorporate, you know, like a hairstyle from the past, but make it modern, what would you say they should do? Um, well, I think in this case, uh, with especially curls, it would be softer and not as hair sprayed. Yes. Not as stiff. You want to be walking like this. Yeah. Not as stiff. I'm going yeah. to the party. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah. Yes. Yeah. And with jeans, it's not as um, gelled and, well, not gelled, more hairspray. I think yeah. it was definitely more hairspray. With jeans, it's more softer, natural looks, more, mm -hmm. more uh, softer waxes just to define some parts of the hair. And in terms of this season, Jenny, where trends are concerned, what can we take from the 70s like right now that's hot and popping? Definitely the plaits. Uh, different styles of plaits, just plaiting in different ways and placing it differently. Um, that and definitely still curls. I think curls is still very big. Um, whether it's timeless, you, yeah. Yes, it's timeless whether you make them big or have them more softer, um, but still definitely more backwards flicks. Okay, and are those tight ones? Uh -uh. Mark, you know, hello, hi. <laughs> nah. Jenny and Marianne, all the best to you. We will Thank be catching you. up with them a little bit later. <laughs> Welcome back, everyone. If you have just joined us, you're tuned into the biggest youth show in Mzansi. It is Hectic Naran. And we are having a hashtag Hectic throwback with our 1970s episode. I'm back in the hair dresser right now. <laughs> the saloon. I'm back here. The salon. I know. The salon. That's how you say it. <laughs> Sebastian looks like he's almost done. He is done. Well, we always finish off with a little bit of hairspray, okay. especially 70s. Okay. So all I did here with Sebastian, just to give it a little bit of texture to make it look more like the 70s. Yeah. I use an iron to curl the hair, give it a little bit of a kink. Okay. And just to create a little bit of texture, the guys mostly wear their hair forward and then separated it okay. wherever it wanted to be. Should we take a step back with all this hairspray? Should we give, it, give him some space? <laughs> you, look, you look like you're going to church, eh, Sebastian? <laughs> I hope you're going to keep this hairstyle for the whole week. Well, guys, that is Sebastian getting his hair dead right now. Jody is still under construction. We'll get to see her a little bit later on. But right about now, it is time for our great reveal. And first things first, let's go to Mr. Sebastian. So you are done with his hair, Jenny, and you told us a little bit about it earlier on. But Sebastian, you can actually look at the plasma right over there. You can see your hairstyle. Tell us what you think. I think I live in the 70s because it hasn't changed much. <laughs> okay, cool. You usually wear your hair like this. But I can see there's been a bit of a dramatic fringe action. Yeah, exactly. Are you usually very careful with the way you do your fringe? and? Depends if I go out, yeah. Oh wow, so your hair is pretty important to you. 
Okay, cool. Well, Sebastian lives in the 70s, but thank you so much, Jenny, just for giving him that Good little shot. bit of definition right over there so we can see the sweep. And you said he, he comes out of a movie, um, a series. That 70s show. That 70s show? Yeah. That's Sebastian right about now. But let's move over to our lovely lady. Ah, this curls look so adorable. Jody looks so beautiful. Tell us about this look quickly. So um, all we did to create this look was to curl uh, the hair with an iron and with a, with a styler mm -hmm. and we pin curl clipped it and back in the 70s they actually did use these pin curl clips to set the hair with because they didn't have the irons and the stylus that oh, we wow. have nowadays. Okay. So we just set it that way as well just to keep the curl in there, uh, took it out and sprayed it down and just I basically just place the hair where we wanted it to be which is obviously as you guys can see more backwards yeah. out of the face but still very much so that you can see droopy and hanging yeah framing yeah. framing okay now Jody you can take a look at the plasma right about now and tell us what do you think of your look are you loving it yeah I actually do like it you like it hey because like gives my hair a lot of volume yeah and you and are you said you love curls as well yeah. oh man guys ow models look so beautiful today thank you so much to our stylists um uh, jenny and marianne for today make sure you go onto facebook and twitter and tell us what you think about them